two years ago, Amanda, over debt-free in sunny California or debt-free in sunny CA coined the hashtag debt free community. And if you don't know her, I'm going to link her Instagram down below and I'll link my Instagram as well. So you should go over and, you know, follow both of us because we're both awesome. So a bunch of us YouTubers decided to get together and celebrate Amanda's hashtag. And so down below, you can check out all the other YouTube channels that love Amanda and love her hashtag. Amanda and her husband just did their debt-free screen back on November 21st. And since it's going to be like a link arama down in my details section, if I can find that one, I'm going to link that too with a little clip right directly to their debt-free screen. It was awesome. Loved it. Oh my goodness. It's always so inspiring when someone you know or someone you internet know, it becomes that free because you get to see like their true enthusiasm. It is so inspiring. So stick around and see how this community, the debt free community inspires us daily. Hi, I'm Wendy Valencia. My husband Mauricio, my daughter Melina, and I are almost two thirds of the way through our redonkulously long debt free journey that I'm pretty sure is going to last until my daughter Melina gets to college and she's seven by the way. So if you are interested in being motivated in your debt free process, whatever step you're on, make sure you click the big old subscribe button down below. So I have been following Amanda since like the end of last year, or maybe the beginning of this year. And I love her Instagram post. She does have a YouTube channel and I'll link that as well, but she is super frequent. She is a super frequent poster on Instagram and her Instagrams are so inspiring. I love Instagram, but I totally suck at it. I mean, like genuinely suck at it. This is the kind of inspiring brilliance you'll see on my Instagram. There is nothing quite as humbling as having your seven-year-old ask you if you've had your tonsils out because the skin on your neck is wiggly. True story. If you're under the age of 30, don't worry. You will understand one day. You will feel my pain. Can we just take a moment for a PSA about why you should take care of your skin when you're young? I mean, seriously, you need to be exfoliating and oil and the whole kit and caboodle from the time you're a teenager on. Anyway, so in celebration, we're going to talk about what the debt-free community actually means to us. So I don't know if you're going to know, but you're probably going to figure it out because you're watching this video, but this hashtag has actually spread to YouTube as well. You can actually search YouTube hashtag debt free community and all of these YouTubers pop up. And I did it about three or four months ago and I discovered a whole host of channels that I never knew existed. So this collab has us answering two questions and they're seemingly simple questions, but oh my goodness, they are so complex when you start to think about them. Question number one, what does the debt-free community mean to me? Hmm. Hmm. Seriously, you guys are 100% the reason that we have made it this far. I'm not even going to give credit to Mauricio and I because we would have given up like one or two months into this process if it weren't for y'all. Oh, not even exaggerating. June. June sucked. We blew our budget so badly. We fell off and we bounced. And we continued to bounce and bounce and bounce and it just got worse as the month went on. June 2016 was a bad month. No joke. There have been so many times I have been frustrated with this process and I will freely admit we are not the beans and rice kind of family. We still have fun. We still put extra money in there. We are committed to getting out of debt. But sometimes I even feel like our kind of fluffy budget is a little too restrictive and it gets on my nerves and I want to throw my hands up in the air and be like, I quit. I'm done. No more. But I committed to y'all 
and y'all follow me for inspiration and to see real life in this whole process. So absolutely, of course, I am going to keep going because I committed to something and I am nothing if not following through with my word. The debt-free community has even brought me some super close friends like Kelly over at Freedom in a Budget. Oh my goodness. She is seriously becoming one of my closest people, confidants, what have you. I talk to her almost daily lately. And anytime we have issues with YouTube or money or whatever, I always have someone who I know is of the mindset that I am that will tell me what I need to do and tell me what I need to hear. And it is so helpful. And then all of you who follow me on Instagram or maybe are in the YouTube Crazies Facebook group that, oh my goodness, I get so much wisdom and inspiration there. It is just fantastic. Question number two is how has the debt-free community helped us in our financial journey? Well, we've paid off $188,177.43 so far. That's a lot of money. And I guarantee if it weren't for y'all, we would have given up a long time ago because you guys are like our accountability partners, really. I mean, like I said, June, 2016, it was ugly. There was debt. It, it was bad. Don't, don't go back to June, 2016 ever. It's not wise. So thank you so much to Amanda for creating this amazing hashtag and uniting us as a community and giving us a place to go and talk about our desires and our goals with like-minded individuals. If it weren't for you, I'd be floating out there by myself somewhere probably. So I'll see you in the next one. See ya. We're out. <laughs>